So a little while ago I ran a little poll with the members and patrons to see what sort of game camera system they wanted to learn to make the most. And of course they picked what I believe to be the most difficult kind of camera system to make. But I'm a man of my word so I'm gonna do my best to simplify it for you. However, before I show you how to set up a third person camera, you need to understand how to alert between positions. Now there are three main ways to transition between positions. The standard is move towards. This is when one object moves to a position at a constant speed. It's not smooth. It's not fast, it's constant. The speed never changes. The second method is lerpin. Just like lerpin with the number, lerpin with the position starts off fast and then gets slower the closer it gets to the target. The last method is called smooth damp. And it's like a lerp, but instead of starting fast and slowing down at the end, it starts slow, gets fast in the middle, and then slows down as it gets to the end. So, what's the code for all this look like? Well, luckily, they all share very similar code. Let's start with lerp. You'll need a transform or a vector 3 to represent your target location. Then you'll need a float to represent your speed. Alright, so to lerp from one position to another, all you need to say is transform.position equals vector3.lerp transform.position, target position, and speed multiplied by delta time. Now, all this means is that we want our object to lerp from its current position to the target position at this speed. If you save, then drag your target object into the target variable and run the game, you will now see our object slowly moves towards the target. Alright, but what if you want to move at a constant speed? Well, that's easy. All you gotta do is change lerp to move towards, and if you run the game now, you can see that our object no longer lerps from one position to another, instead it's constant the whole way. What about smooth damp? What's that look like? Well, it's almost the same, but we need to add a variable up here for velocity. Then change the words down here from move towards to smooth damp. And right in front of speed, we add a comma to make space for our new variable. Save, you're done. Something important to notice is unlike lerp and move towards where the slower speed is, the slower the movement, with smooth damp, the higher the speed, the slower the movement. I don't know why it works this way, but uh, that's how you use it. Anyway, hope that helps. And as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.